A 22-year-old tow truck driver killed by a suspected drunk driver. Edgar Zavala Asturias has been arrested and is now facing an intoxication manslaughter charge. Tonight, local tow truck drivers say that accidents involving their vehicles happen several times a week. Aaron Jones live for us tonight in Irving. And Aaron, these drivers have a message for all of us. They do, Doug. They say once again, this highlights just how dangerous their job can be. They work all hours of the night, as you can see, and they say people really need to be more responsible and aware of how detrimental their actions can be. Way too often in this industry that uh, these tragedies happen. Just last Friday, we, uh, we buried an a, a, a employee of mine, Zach Johnson. Joe Baker says the 25 year old tow truck driver was just doing his job, repossessing a car when a man who claimed it was his shot and killed him last week. And today is now Wednesday, and we're looking at burying another tow brother. It's just too much. Irving police say Tuesday night around 7 p.m., 22 year old Joshua Hanau was loading a car onto his wrecker parked off 183 near the North O'Connor exit when 38 year old Edgar Zavala Astarius hit him. Police believe he was drinking. He's now facing an intoxication manslaughter charge. You no, know, they're so distracted out here on the streets that they just don't make good decisions. Don't make bad decisions. If you drink and and, and get behind the wheel, this is what happens. It happens very often. Uh, a lot of, uh, especially on the weekends or whatnot, but there's a, there's a lot of accidents. I would say uh, several a week, three, four a week. Brent Lamont says all these tow trucks in his shop waiting to be repaired is evidence of this. Yes, it's preventable. Don't drink, don't drive. There is so many companies out here, not just tow companies, that will come and pick you up and make sure you make it home safe. And in the same respect, every other driver wants to do their job and make it home. And at the time of his death, Hanau was working for a company that contracts with AAA. His funeral arrangements are still being planned. Reporting live in Irving tonight, Aaron Jones, CBS 11 News.